next time you have guests for dinner, here's something to do before they leave the table. Start off by placing a serviette on the table and folding it diagonally. Then take a salt shaker and put it over on one side of the serviette. Then place a knife on the serviette pointing towards the salt shaker. Sharp end towards the salt shaker. Now, remember, if you choose the salt carefully, you may be lucky enough to find magnetic salt. I think I've found some in this one. Then start rolling up the serviette, like so. When you get halfway rolled, switch the salt shaker to the other side and keep rolling the serviette like that. And then, if you're lucky, you may find that the knife remembered that it was magnetic salt in the salt shaker so that when you unroll it, yes, the knife has remembered to turn that way. Now you might say, wait a minute, I must have missed something. All right, watch again. Now, you'll agree with me that the knife, the sharp end of the knife, is pointing towards the salt shaker. We roll the serviette up, roll it up, and then quickly switch the side for the salt. Unroll it, and I think you'll find once again that the knife is remembered, and it's switched back, and now it's pointing at the salt. Well, what's going on here? Well, you may have wondered why I started with the serviette folded. There was a very good reason for it. Have a look at this. There was already a knife pointing to the other side. When I folded it across like that and then made this knife point towards the salt shaker, I knew that by rolling this up towards that point, doesn't matter what I do with the salt shaker, I knew that when I got it up here, because I'd made that end of the serviette go a little bit further than the other one, I could eventually make the lower part flip out like that, and then that becomes the top end. And I've actually turned the serviette over so now we've got the other knife that's pointing that way. Follow? Still a bit hard to follow, isn't it? Look, doesn't matter what I put in here. This time I'll bundle up a serviette in with that knife. Now I'll fold all that up like that. And what I'm doing is rolling the serviette up, flipping the whole thing over so that now whatever was on the other side is hidden. Here's the second knife, the one I put down pointing towards the salt shaker. And now the first knife and the rolled up paper serviette are hidden under there. Every time I roll and unroll, I know that I can turn the serviette upside down. So it appears as if the knife changes from side to side, but it doesn't really. And you probably won't understand it fully until you try it yourself with the dinner guests.